We're having a Magic Kingdom morning. Yes. And we're early enough to catch the welcome show. <laughs> Let's go get a spot. Oh my goodness, look at the time. I better get right to this. <clears throat> it is hereby decreed that all are welcome in this happy place where the young and the young at heart can explore and laugh and play together. Here where magic awaits you around every corner. And now, to officially welcome you today, the one and only Mickey Mouse! Well, now that everybody's here, I think it's time to start the day. And that means it's time for just a little bit of magic. Magical day, Sarah. We thought we'd maybe be able to run over or briskly walk over. He's running, briskly walk over to this since we were right there, park open. But I know this line is like still filtering through the standby, but it's still looking like maybe a 30 minute wait. And I don't know if we said we did, I don't, I know we didn't. Sarah nabbed some, some awesome fast passes day of. Yeah, this morning, I like that. You got. We got Space Mountain, Buzz Lightyear, and Seven Dwarfs. Woo! For like 12.50. So, so it must have been someone deleted it and I like was just there perfectly snapped. Let's head back to Main Street maybe. Yeah. And just that's why enjoy. You always scour. Every time you refresh, people are canceling. You never know what you can find. Ooh. Guys, we've never done this before. We hopped on one of the Main Street cars. Not this one. I'm not allowed on that one after the... Um, the, beeping incident. the beeping incident of the uh, photo pass day. Hi! But we're on this, this semi closed in where I won't get in as much trouble. Montage because that was so beautiful. I'm redeeming this... myself for uh, Buzz Lightyear since I didn't become a galactic hero last time. <laughs> I must do it today. Prove it! <laughs> I was so cool. We call this the scenic route. <laughs> we never have actually taken it this way. Though. We, when we take it, we take it the other way. Right. Well, I, my family used to take this a lot when it was Toontown. But I don't know. Because there used to be like a cool billboard that said Toontown on the cap. Um, I'll put in a funny photo of us here because we were making fun of a family who just took a picture in front of it and they looked so incredibly unhappy <laughs> to be there but they were like taking a family photo so I'll put that goofy photo in. Mansion. I am your host, your ghost 
Well, we were really doing awesome when we first got here, knocking out all the the ride times and everything. But uh, we left. We left the ride just now, and it got packed. I think we might go do Country Bear. What do you think? You feeling it? Sarah's secret favorite, and not secret, just her favorite. Um, this is absolutely unheard of. This is the line for Country Bear Jamboree. Excuse me, I love all of you for appreciating Country Bear Jamboree, but come on guys. What's with this? This is like... Oh, you know what sir? I don't know if it's opened up for the day yet. That's cool. So we'd probably get in. Let's wait until they open the door and see. And wait till this line gets in there. Learn something new every day. Oh, Big Al's feeling very thankful for everybody everybody coming to see their show. Uh, Liver Lips is, is in line for Country Bear Jamboree. I hope he gets a good spot. This will easily be the most packed Country Bear Jamboree we've ever seen. Are you excited? This is the first of the day. This is also cool too. cool to see like a, a packed house in Country Bear Jamboree and it's definitely a busy day. Peter Pan at the 75, Small World's a 20 minute. If that's any indication for you on how busy the park is. And it's only like 11, 20. But we are hoping to, I'm hoping we're gonna get lucky and get to do a great moments in history right now. Hear ye, hear ye. I am James Jefferson, the town crier of Liberty Square. It's Sandy Eagle, everybody. <laughs> Tell us, Sam, what great American story are we sharing today? Today we shall salute the Declaration of Independence. Ah, a great story indeed. Okay, places, everyone. Sam, JJ, take it away. All right, friends, what do you say? Want to help us make history? Yeah. Music. The year is 1776. 1776. All together now. Life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Great moments in history. Great moments in history. Great moments in history. <laughs> Sarah loves the good Muppets. Historical, American historical representation. So it's just fun. Those are like real puppets. I didn't. I thought they'd be like animatronics when they first announced it. But they're like 
they are Muppets. What? Should I leave my hat on for this one? No. It's the same hat. I know. I wouldn't do it. You know, sometimes you just walk past an attraction and you gotta do it. Well, we had left Fantasyland, so we were gonna have the quick, quick ride there, but we're like, we're gonna go to Adventureland. And we can't go find this. Why not? He just said Instagram. This robot is half like them for taking photos. <laughs> and even said these better go on Instagram. Okay, well, I'd say this is like an extremely productive morning. I'm actually yeah. And I think we're about to use our last Fast Pass for Space Mountain. But we might just go hang out on Main Street before we do the grand finale for the day at the park and do the, the two fall parade. Because we, have, we haven't seen this before the hurricane, we realized. Because we're never able to see it during the week. Always. Look out the two ride. If you're with two people. You'll see us in line all the way to the city with my, with my peace sign going on, ready for, like, say, Castamer to throw up there. So I'd be like... And then we've skipped, like, numerous times on this ride. We've skipped all of this. It seems we just skipped, like, 15 people. I didn't, have my, I didn't have my camera ready, but we got the two ride. Well, I'm sure I've mentioned it before, but that is my favorite ride in all Disney World. And I, we got set in the, the second, the last two seats, which is awesome because you feel the bumps and drops more and that. I wasn't actually the back Wait, back. Ooh. Look how beautiful it is outside. It smells. I know, the smells are killing me right now with uh, how hungry I am. But we're gonna find a spot for the parade, but I just had to tell you guys that that's my favorite ride, and that was so much fun. Thanks for getting all those fast passes. Yeah, we haven't been on that one in a while either. And I looked for additional fast passes, and they're pretty much wiped out until like 7 o'clock tonight. We won't be here. Uh, we are not up on the times on the daily operations. We thought the parade got moved to 2 o'clock, but I guess that was just a rumor? No, it did. Well, it's going at 3 o'clock today. Adeline. We're gonna go, I think we're gonna lounge a little bit maybe yeah. in the Grand Floridian lobby and then, then we'll go home. We just didn't want to commit to staying until almost four. So we're just gonna head out now. But it was a great, great morning. Well, well, well. If this isn't a way to greet you in the lobby of the Grand Floridian, I just don't know what is. <laughs> Cinderella's carriage made from the bakery. And Sarah pointed out something interesting. We got a little snack. Sarah got Fruity Pebbles and I got this because I've been jonesing for a Coke Zero. Sarah pointed out something that uh, I didn't realize before. We've never been here for Easter. So we might try to plan something for Easter morning to do like a nice brunch or breakfast or something because we're not going home this year for Easter. It's one of those holidays that we've wanted to, but because of the Violet, the Violet being born and all these other trips that we aren't going to happen every year, uh, we're not going to go back to Chicago for Easter this year. So we'll have to do something fun. It is hours later, hours, and I'm gonna run, and I didn't realize I was gonna run that far, but I ran far, I ran like six miles. So we were just kind of like laying low, uh, thank you for your patience for yesterday's vlog. So I was working diligently on it while I was in the run, and so when I came back she was still finishing that up. And then we were just kind of doing stuff uh, around the apartment and then just fell asleep on the couch. So. That's what our evening was, but we had a great morning, a really, really festive morning, and then I went on that run, and so I was doing design work and stuff for Button, so thank you again for following along with us. It's good to be home.
We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>